I left off, you guys mowed through, got the artifact, met up with an old creepy guy. Krom, I can't pronounce your name. Uh, Karn. Yo, Karen. Karen, okay. And then uh, you guys were talking with the Inquisitor. Inquisitor and his son, you reading the device. You guys hence closed the device and. Yeah, now you make your way off the vessel. Out of character. Don't forget to turn your helmet comms back on. Whoever I turned it off on. I mean, he's probably going to keep it off because he doesn't want to talk to him. <laughs> I'm just reminding him that it's turned off. He probably has no just choose a different channel <laughs> and only talk to the, uh, the dropship because that's the only guy we need to talk to. It really is. Yeah, I'll right. And, and you guys do have that channel, by the way. Oh, we do. Yeah, he that was the last thing he did that he sent you guys a a frequency for the next channel. All right, brother. So let's make our way to the exit. I believe we were going down south. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Then let us proceed. Why can I not rotate this? There we go. You guys hear that in the distance? Here behind one. you guys. Uh, oh, behind. Bing a bing a bing a bing a bing. Oh. I believe something approaches from the rear. We should make haste. Something walking or gunshot? Uh, you're discerning it as possible gunfire. I mean, keep moving. At this point, if we've not seen any from my team, I would presume they are all dead. happening right why is guys. it what ex did you set landmines no you're hearing explosions oh no i was asking them we didn't set landmines but they did a lot of them hmm disorganized rabble yep tech marine did your mapping device has it yet uh established a proper map of the vicinity Mm, allow me to uh, get it out of my pocket. I shall guard this corner. We need at least a direction to go in instead of just aimlessly wandering around the Space Hulk. All right. Uh, you make an excellent point. So, I mean, you to, to for days or weeks. Pilot. I'd like to do a tech use roll to uh, use my. All right, let's see. What is it? I forgot. It's tech use. The Auspex scanner. That's what it is. Or no, no, the cartograph. All right, I'd like to use the cartograph to uh, get a bearing on where we're going. So tech use, what's the roll on that? Minus 40. Minus 40, all right. Okay, he succeeded. Sweet. You know that there is an elevator shaft down this way. Alright, I relay that information to the kill team. Very well. Excellent. Now a moment. Squad leader to dropship pilot. This is the squad leader, Eric Ladies, to the dropship pilot. Okay, let me get him up. Okay. I was about to begin real life radio communications. Yeah. <laughs> Double cross intersection. 
I believe Dan is our dropship pilot voice. Yes. Whoever that is adjacent to me, I'm going to pie the corner slightly. No. On the long axis, if that makes sense. Uh, All right. I'm pieing to look here if you want to... Hello it. there, kill team. Looks like we have some friends. I had to go to hide it. Relay coordinates now. Excellent, pilots. We will be going heading in your direction shortly. Prepare for a hot uh, egress. You ready? Hold on. I'm going to put the dropship caps that Pat says. Roger that. Just to let you know, my scanners are picking up incoming boogies and sure of origin. <laughs> I bogeys. believe it's pronounced bogies. <laughs> Don't worry about <laughs> it. <laughs> I believe it's pronounced future corpses. Yes. Also that. Right. Also, so, pilots, be advised. Uh, you need to be extremely wary of anything coming from Imperial ships. <laughs> they may end up being aggressive. Uh-oh, you really wanted to open that can of worms. <laughs> hey, this guy seems all right. <laughs> I want him to them to only accept communicate Death Watch. Uh, Roger that, not picking up Imperial signals from these. Understood. Okay, uh, you guys hear muttering voices in the next room? Um, define next room because there's three of them. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Carnage uh, actually going sees a, a, a <laughs> down there. Okay. grenades. All right, before we assault, give me one moment. Possibility shielding everybody. I, I'm pulling out Better, my morning field. And so are you, are you poking and sneaking around the corner there and looking and stealthily doing this, right? Yeah, it would be stealth. Okay, so do that so that make sure they don't see you first. So you right. get your and surprise I've possibility shielded everybody. Cool. I would assume you would have done that before you got to whoever got to the corner. Yeah, I mean, we've got a destination now, so. Yep. Popping up. Page 32. That's the wrong book. And just to let you know, Karen, possibility shield means that you get a plus 10 on any roll during your turn. Ah, yeah, that's kind of what I was about to look up. Yep. Which can be a damage roll as well. Yep. All it says is just plus 10 to any roll. Okay. It did not specify skill check or ability checks or anything else, just rolls. Very well. Rolls Royce. And that's what a squad mode ability? No, that is uh, one of my psychic powers. Okay. Well, speaking of which, should I put on? But the, uh, uh, if you're joining our squad, uh, which maybe he should he needs to go to squad. At track. this point, you probably I, maybe I, would I have joined the squad mode. I'm uh, presuming I would have at this point. Uh, we also get uh, plus ten on all ballistic skill and weapon skill rolls against space uh, chaos space marines. Very well. Yeah. If it's anything else, we don't get that bonus, but specifically against Chaos Space Marines, we get plus 10 on weapon and ballistic skills. Okay. I was going to say, if I figure out how to activate my squad mode, I have Siege Breaker, which might be useful. Uh, our kill team leader should be tracking down the cohesion we have. And we have like one. Yeah, so we can't really do any squad mode abilities yet. Very yeah, well. we're we're out of cohesion for squad mode abilities. We used it on one thing, and uh, it was immediately not used. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Wait, uh, yeah. what did we use our cohesion on? So they, we thought we felt they were about to, you know, come storming us at a point. So we used strong point. Okay. Which used all of our cohesion, and then they didn't come at us. Oh right. What was that, yeah. two sessions ago? Yep. Yep. Yeah, okay. They just landmine all around yeah. you guys. 
Does yeah, they were they have... landmined and retreated, so we had to find our way around. But we Before. burned through our cohesion. Oh, we go. Does anyone have a grenade? No, I have something a little better. I'm going to activate the uh, the passion divine power from uh, one of my things. We Very now well. have unnatural agility times two, and if you already have that, it's times three. Oh, oh boy. Okay, so whoever picked you on the corner you need to stealth check or silent silent move. It also adds plus 10 to dodge and parry tests and allows you to roll them twice to determine the higher result. Oh, nice. Oh, considering oh considering my stuff, that's... uh, Yeah. Nice. I'll have to remember that minute. Who's uh, who's rolling for their stealth? And it's whoever peeked around the corner. First. Who saw them first? I believe that would be oh, Krom. No, I can't, I can't see them. I haven't peeked. I looked around the other corner. I looked oh, over uh, here. Technically, ah. from where I'm standing, I can see the tech marine. I was not intending on going peeking around the corner, but I technically can see the space marine down there. Right, so, so. it'd be you that peeked. That's fine. Yeah, I figured it'd be whoever was up here opposite me who could see the oh. ups opposite room. All yep. right, I'll roll for stealth then, sure. Yep, silent move. I'm assuming you're all doing that, right? I yeah, stopped. I mean, it'd be good. Sure. Uh, modifier? Huh? Uh, plus 20. Okay. I don't I'll make see a sound. You. Yep. Okay. So you're informing, or whoever's informing them that they're there, so you guys can then do your surprise round. Correct. Where's our tech marine? Below you. Uh, yeah, I'm right. Oh, I'm right okay. Here. Sorry. My. My name is covering you completely. Yeah. It, we, we, can always hi, we can always hide the nameplates. We should probably hide the nameplates. How do we hide the nameplates? Okay, so I'll do that. I think you guys can do that on your own. Yes. No, it doesn't look like I think it's just it. deleting the name of the thing, right? Oh, there you Good go. Enough. No, there's yeah, actually a little, there's a check mark nameplate. Yeah, we don't have that. Yeah. Uh, oh, no. well then. I got rid it, of mine. It's cool. I deleted my name, so it's no longer there. <laughs> yes. You're now also Black Shoot. Got it. Yeah. I mean, your go. icons are, are unique enough. It's fine. <coughs> I'm one with a shield. I'll be happy. Well, then um, we can confuse you for the one with the shield. What one with the shield? I've got the biggest shield there is. But is it the toughest? Is it what? Is it the it's toughest? The toughest. I mean, it's literally 50 points of armor, so it's pretty fucking tough. It's not... It's protection rating. It's like the uh, power field thing. Unless you actually meant armor. Well, the protection rating it is just no, armor, right? Protection rating, no, no. protection rating is the power field that like, the shield comes with, basically. Okay. Uh, like every uh, like storm shields and up, they have a power field around them that protects uh, against any like range attacks and melee attacks. Basically, I think they. I don't remember if they actually do protect against melee attacks. I believe but... it's energy or energy attacks they protect against. So kinetic fire, plasma, that kind of thing. They won't protect yeah. against melee attacks. And protection rating means basically the higher it is, the better, because that like if it, each time you take damage, you need to roll a 1d100. And if it rolls under that protection rating, then the field stays active. Uh, if it but rolls if over... It rolls, if it rolls like uh, 1 to 5 or whatever, then it turns off, which yours yeah. had. Yeah. So uh, storm shields... Uh, which, I'm not using uh, a storm shield. Yeah, which are like, normally used by the Death Watch or like Space Marines. They give you plus four armor to your left arm or like the arm you're carrying it with and plus four to body. Uh, boarding shields are obviously uh, bigger. So I probably do have some more armor or more coverage, but like that's up to DM to determine, I guess. Because I don't think the boarding shields are mentioned in any part of the rule books. They're not. Uh, so I, I think had... they're mentioned in the Dark Heresy rulebook, but they're the non Astartes ones. Mm -hmm. They kind of suck. The DM yeah. had one of those, I think. We, uh, I remember when, um, Norsk and I were looking into the boarding shield. Basically, I 
took like another shield that is mentioned that's like a tier up and then I just kind of fudged the numbers on that a bit. I trust I trust you damn damn break it. If it becomes a problem, we'll we'll revisit it. Alright. All right. Sweet. So okay. I trust everyone here is super smart, so well, like and we're that. also not trying to throw the game either. We're trying to make a fun experience. <laughs> I gave this shield 32 points of armor. <laughs> no, 50. <laughs> but I don't know Ooh. the... I don't know... Uh, I'm not entirely no sure how that calculates, like how protective... 50 points works. of armor? It would add 50 to whatever armor it's attached to. Right. Like, the body. normal armor. Right. So is that what protection so that rating does? No. Protection, no, no, no. Protection rating is just a roll thing. Yeah, he explained it. Uh, oh, there's, a, oh. there's a force shield. Mm -hmm. Okay, got it. That makes a lot more sense. Because of that, be you be a, you have more armor than actual tanks. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I one of us already does at this point. Close, yeah, that's true. But he's armored up to the gills. Yes. All right. All right, go. All right. Uh, what's the plan here? All right, who's uh, opening up on him? Grab flanking positions, I mean, throw I a can... grenade, and charge him. I like this plan. Fair enough. All right. What was it again? Uh, firing up, then throwing a grenade? What was the order again? Uh, flanking positions, throw a grenade, Charge him. I am ready to charge. Lay covering fire during the charge. So, are you guys moving across the doorway? Or are you guys going to stay where you're at? Uh, the Menango think... would stay where he is at, I think. Okay. Because if someone's going to cross the doorway, you'll have to roll a stealth check. Or a silent uh, move. Uh, well, we can throw a grenade and, you know, charge them and those who are ranged can move across and then, you know. Yes. Alright. Let the melee... Melee bastards move in while the range people get ready. Yeah. After yeah. the grenade. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We should probably roll for initiative, huh? Yeah. Let me clear. Want to clear the tracker. Yeah, because it it always gets fudged up with your. Hey. Are we we good don't. To roll we technically we technically don't have to do initiative until the surprise round is over, but we might as well Correct. get it on the books. Well, the initiative just lets us know what order during the surprise round that we can act. Correct. Uh, sure. Also oh, true. Yeah. You know, uh, it, it just it, it's a help, but we can ignore it in the first round, you know. Right. Also, we're getting uh, our agility bonus again on this roll because. Oh right, uh, yeah. Oh god, mine's like a nineteen. Oh. So it's gonna be fifteen no then. Oh my god. Ah. Uh, modifier so being what time two? I don't know. It's going to be nine. So I don't even know what mine is anymore. You're not even on the tracker yet because I am you did it before. I was the on the track. No, I was on the tracker. They took me off. They put me I put, put back on. Then I was pulled back off. Uh, they do the thing again and then put your old value in, basically. I don't know. Well, I don't know how to. I'll go put him on the list last time. So he's going to do it again. Yeah, a uh, third time. I don't know my agility modifier, so. Uh, uh, what's your agility number? Forty-five. Then it's, it's four. four. Okay. So times two, it would be an eight. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Anytime it's asking for a modifier, it's basically the ten. Uh, no, no, no. I'm using this little macro thing, so I have no clue how that. Oh. Uh, so yeah. your five should be um, a nine. Yeah, I already see a problem with you guys taking your names off your tokens. I don't see the names on the turn counter, so... I never saw uh, anyone else's name. I never I mean, saw I them anyway. I only ever yeah. saw my name. We could right. Or, yeah, but I, for the GM... I need you guys to name your tokens real quick. There. I just did that. And it... Yeah, I got I got crumbs. Okay. Well, it's not showing for me either, it's, so... It's not showing up yet. Well, it's, yeah, no, it's showing on the turn counter. It's not showing on the screen, if that's helpful. And then Heracleides, I'll fix your token real quick. Bam. There you go. Cool. Which shows There's... the way to make those names smaller. 
on the tokens. Uh, I don't think so. I don't have any option for that. Well, it's yeah. it's weird because when we zoom in and out, uh, it's the same it size. Yeah, it doesn't scale at all, which is super oh. annoying. Someone just committed suicide. What? What happened? Someone just. I mean, that's just normal, though. Yep. <laughs> yeah, in this yeah, campaign. This point. <laughs> why is my roll? Why is my initiative lower than what I rolled? What'd you roll? Uh, nine. Well, it was a nine, and then we added. It's uh, it's four point five higher than that, or four higher than that. You need to click on your token when you do the initiative. I, no, no, no. I did. I rolled. Oh. It put it in, and now it's lower. I watched it go from a nine to an eight. Uh, uh, watching just, probably eyes. because it rounds to the lowest. Uh, it might take there. only a whole number. So if it's adding four point five for whatever reason. No, no, no. It showed nine. There we go. Then it, it, it probably just didn't eight. save. Yes, and it's also yeah. Probably just clicked off if, before saving the number. Or or I messed with it or something like that. <laughs> like, yeah, I still don't see. Your, no, also a thirteen. Oh. So if you click on your thing in the turn order. You can edit it right in the turn order. No. Oh. So whatever. Go. Yeah, there you go. Ah, uh, there we go. Math, see it's math, be mathing. All right, everyone, good. All right, go yeah. ahead and do your surprise round. Surprise round. Let me pull up their little dam. Okay, for my surprise round. Boom. I take my move action while holding the other things. Oh. All right. Moth. Awesome. <laughs> right. Uh, right, yeah. I can actually get there. That's interesting. And everyone in that aura is uh, in my possibility shield. If you step outside of it, you don't get it. But as long as you're in it, you uh, you have it. All right. Perfect. <clears throat> Although if that move, I guess I could have moved further south. They've all got ranged weapons, right? No. The enemies? So. Yes, the enemies. Yep. Oh, they okay, all have yeah. bolters, and then a few have heavy bolters. I now have to move past a very, very small human. Damn Inquisitors. So I, I've i got a couple of the uh, Acid Chaos mines in my inventory still. I'd like to uh, MacGyver that with a grenade uh, and see if I can toss it in their direction. Oh, Jesus Christ. How Do you far mind if we move that? away from you first? You what? So, you know, in case you ex do you mind if we move away from you first in case you uh, explode? I'll I'll reposition before I throw it. <laughs> All right. Are you guys going with that? Yeah. So. Okay. Depending on your roll, I'll I'll tell you how long it takes you. All right. So this is like. Oh, I thought we were going in order. Why did you just go before me? Uh, uh, no, 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 we're not. It's the it's the uh, surprise uh, round. We're just kind of. Until we actually do stuff. anything, they don't know we're here. Yep. Surprise yeah. round. So we basically all get to take our turn at the same time. And then the next round, they'll react. Yes. So now who crossed the, the doorway, though? That would be me. That's, you have to yeah. make a stealth move check. All right, yeah. I'll do that. Silent move. Silent move. And I already have minus 20 because of my power armor history. Hey, I, I got it. a natural agility, too, though. Or That's three. true. All right, so now I'm going to do a tech use roll okay. to uh, MacGyver a uh, acid grenade. So I can engage this one. Here. Minus 30. Oh, I forgot right. to include the Manego in the turn list. Sorry. One moment. Hey, I got it. Hey, it's going to take about 30 seconds to craft this. 30 seconds. So All in right. other words, about 30 rounds. Five rounds? <laughs> yeah. Wait, sorry, that's gonna be Dominico's turn. If uh, you guys want to wait for him to do his thing, and then then yeah, yeah as as long as we don't trigger them now, we should be good for a bit. Yeah, brothers, this will only take thirty seconds. This will take but a moment. I believe we can use their acid mines against them. Hey, yeah, uh, give me what? What's this? What is concealment, right? 
Or... Uh, silent move. Silent move, because you're you're doing stuff. Alright. Make sure you take that plus ten. Yeah. Yeah, true. I'll do that. Because you're trying hey. to do this successfully. Okay, two more. Two more? Alright. Yeah, it's minus thirty. Minus thirty. Mm-hmm. All right, so that would be a barely a success then. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're gonna do. Oh, you rolled a ten on that one. That one's still good. Moth, what is your character's name? Resora Adeline. So it'd be minus. F do I get the possibility shield? Yeah, uh, for it's each every roll? round. Every round. All and right. This would be over multiple rounds. So yeah. Yeah. All uh, right. One more. Cool. I think you know what to do with that silent roll. Oh no! <laughs> I, think you, I think you know what to do with that one too. <laughs> right? Yes. They're gonna be they're gonna be alerted, and then no surprise round. So All right. Be I'm gonna order. I'm gonna re-roll both of those oh. fate points. Remember okay. the plus ten you get for re-rolling it. Yes. Before I forget, you have uh, two squad cohesion. My armor gives you plus one. Oh, nice. So we have a total I, of two then. Yes. My arm. Yeah. Okay. One more. If I was playing my dead character, we'd still have like ten. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. It's a shame uh, you shot yourself in the face. Yep. Sister, as soon as we move, uh, we engage the one on the Hey, here you go. Front. You just got it. I did. Just barely look at that. Yep, you're like you're just silently craft like shh. I'm crafting here. <laughs> For I'm seconds. crafting, yeah. Just imagine you guys just sitting and watching this idiot do that. I'm just <laughs> sitting here with a shield, just like, let me at him. Let me at him. All right, so I'm going to... And I'm uh, standing behind you. Uh, I'm going to bounce a grenade off of this wall. Oh. That's in my face. Please, Please don't no. do that. No? Okay. I have There's a too many people right there if you miss. What if All you right. instead just throw it in the middle of them instead of doing fancy yeah, right? shit? <laughs> yeah, just yeet it into the middle of them like a sensible goober. All right, here oh, we go. Um, we need to hurry this up, brothers. Was this multiple turns or was this one turn? By the way, this is a couple of turns. turns. Couple but of turns. Right I'm around the corner. Those gunshots. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. Quickly, right. throw the grenade. Charge. We need if to finish gonna, this now. If it's going to be multiple turns, I would like to spend one turn aiming with Dominico. All right. Let's see. So this has a ten meter radius. I'll aim too then while we're waiting. I'm gonna ready to charge. That's about all I can do. Oh no! I'm gonna fate point that. <laughs> Please. You absolutely. Don't forget the plus ten from the possibility shield. Oh yeah, true. So that would be minus one point eight. Okay. Right, but for your reroll. Right, and then I get the fate point. 10, the plus so ten for Plus twenty. Plus twenty. Yep. Nice. All right, we're gonna do this again. If I get to the correct page, I was deducting the fade point. I was uh, updating the roll 20 to use the updated uh -huh. blue. Oh my god. Oh. Sir, can you. Brothers, can I get a fate point? You can have yes, mine. Take, all right. <laughs> all right, here we go. One more. I think I got it. I should have it this time. Oh! Barely? <laughs> Barely. Okay. All right. Plus for ten. All right. So, yeah, it's that gonna land immediately next to us. Oh, and it's ten meter radius. I think we'll be okay. Sensors picking up contacts. Yes. Hey, Crazy how those people were moving during a re-roll of a roll, but cool. All right, my roll for damage. Oh my right? god. Oh my god. That's <laughs> pathetic. <laughs> Can I that's roll it? awareness with Karnov? Wait, that's all that that mine was going to do? Do we deserve He rolled a 1 and a 2 plus a 5. That was Even if he... Keep in mind, that will melt hands. their armor. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Same thing. yeah uh, so they lost 8 points of armor on their legs. Alright. They have 2 armor on the legs. Splish, oh, no, splash. Right. No, they have 10. Okay, so no, they... Yeah, let's see. Do we detect, or... Are we aware of those people? We that person be. behind you? Yeah, 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 yeah. The gunfire is getting closer and closer. I can yeah. physically see one out of the corner of my eye. Yep. So, yes. 
uh, he does not look like a Chaos Marine, though. He actually looks like one of your old squad mates. Data squad, check in. You just see him kind of eye you and just continue firing down, down the way. Oh, he's firing down. Okay. I don't that means probably well, you should know if that's that. normal behavior or not. Keep in mind, there was a dreadnought that direction. Remember? Yes, yep. there was. There was so, two, in fact. Yes. And why right, does that he... look like someone from my old squad? Yes. Yeah, you recognize him. Oh. He looks looks beat to hell. You thought he was long dead. The last time you saw him was like in the reactor room, like like a couple days ago. Temp, uh, I'm debating in character, just re literally turning and gra going to grab him. Uh, what's the uh, what's our captain's boyo's name in here? Who is it? Eric Lady's. Oh, Eric Lady's. Also, Domingo. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you know, there's two of us. Oh, oh, even better. That is a member of Team Theta. By the way, Norsk, if you want to leave it up to chance, you could do a willpower check to see if you can resist the urge to go grab him physically. <laughs> You'd probably fellowship check to see if you can get him in line. Yeah, true. Dominico. Where is my fellowship check at? Uh, you would just click on willpower fellowship on your characters and skills. That'll generate a pop-up. Do we have any modifiers? We do. Oh, this sounds like a personal check, so you make up yeah. your own modifiers. Yep. What is your willpower struggling against right now? Ah, uh, help you help him. Well, hey, we're right next to each other, so as long as he moves this way, he'll be fine. <laughs> More fine. Just yell out to him to come this way. So, you know him as, uh, this. Ooh. Alright, I'm gonna switch to, uh, Theta Team's comms. Sergeant Talos, this is Krom. Make your way towards us. We will engage as a group. He kinda just looks your way and keeps firing still. Oh, for fuck's sake. Emperor's sake, his comms may be broken. It could be a trick, brothers. Do we have time to debate this? We just threw a grenade at a group. Of four Charge people. them! It's Shoot all happening them at the same go. time. <laughs> yes, it's all happening at the same time. I'm presuming this is all, bit. like, same yep. time. So now we're going to turn orders. Oh. I've already... Domenico already shot the... Uh, what was this? Was it all going on? He shot at the... Space Marines. Okay, space Hashtag space. Domenico shot first. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and he dealt oh. that much damage total uh, to each one? Yeah, uh, to like 19, 11, yada, yada, yes. Um, also, he I is can't on the turn order, but he's at the very bottom. He needs Whatever that thing is, I can't I can't click on guys. Uh, I can I can remove it. I removed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do I still see it? You might have to delete it. You have to remove thing. it yourself. Yeah, it's oh, a little oh, garbage do... can icon. I can't even click it. Oh. Mm, change layers? What layer would that be on? The normal player layer? T token layer. I am, token, I am on the token layer. I still can't click it. I want to uh, re re refresh. Whatever that is, it seems busted. Uh, it is. You put you put the line on Linger. Yes, I did. Uh, I can put it to instant. Is, is, it, is it gone now? Maybe. Try putting another one down? Or... Okay, it's gone now. I had to refresh. Okay. I had to refresh though. Moth now left one. Okay, yeah. it's gone now. It, okay. it should go away if you go uh, instant one and put another line down. Yes. Yeah, please do. Instant. You can also uh, click the broadcast to others thing. Yes. So okay. just, you know, turn that off when doing it. So that, and that that calculation takes armor into account, right? Yes. So that's like five different shots doing that. Uh, like 19, 11, 10, that amount of damage. Uh, all, all of them? The hit was to the head, so like it's like all going through their head armor, which is oh, yeah. four. A nine, God well, they're, they're, they're all dead then. Oh, all well. Right. Oh, Jesus. Wait, all dead? Didn't yeah, even eight. need that grenade. Uh, well, I mean, that's what, 81 points of... of... 
Not, no, no. no it, it is 19 damage, different 11 holes. damage, 10 damage, 22 okay, first, damage, 19 damage. First one's damage. dead. Second one's dead. Third one is dead. Fourth one has one HP. All right, cool. <laughs> so, Even after third, the fifth shot, like there was five shots. Just wait for yeah. a fly to land on the, him, the brother. The 10 probably so wasn't die. a single hit. The 10 probably wasn't a single hit, so it took the 22 after. Yes. No, no, let's see. Uh, 19 brought him down to 1. 11 brought him down to 0. Killed him outright. 10, mm -hmm. right? That's 2. And then 22, and then 19 gets 1. All right, got it. All right. Also, the money goes at the bottom of a turn order, just letting you know. Like he has 19, he wrote a 19 on his initiative. Yeah, it's yeah. cycling through now. No, I had oh. to sort button. For oh, Sora. shit. He's dead, isn't he? I rolled in that one. I think yep. he's gonna die. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's dead. Yeah. Oh my god. Two tens yep. in there. That acid bomb, too. Let What's me... great is, is it's definitely making it from damage alone to glease through his chest armor. <laughs> I mean, he had one HP. I know, but I'm saying, even if he didn't, you would have at least done damage even if out the 20 penetration. Mm -hmm. And most likely killed him. Okay. Brothers, watch out for that blob of Hollywood acid. <laughs> 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 it's ah. the dip. Anyone got okay. any chips? Hang on, I'm going to turn kind of and, and go help my... <laughs> you guys are still in turn orders, so... Yes. And then, so it's... I mean, he goes... goes who, who else did a surprise action? Hey. Uh, Karnoff has not used his surprise action, I guess. But there's, no. like, he doesn't see any targets, so he doesn't know... What to do. <laughs> would, I would assume into the room. So uh, it's up to you what you want to do. Or... need to go into the room, since their or, targets are or, dead. Or this guy, because you don't know who he is. Yeah, there's a. Yeah, you can charge him. I've been calling out. I will just stand in front of our psyker just to protect him from any uh, unwanted attacks. Excellent. Right. I now have two invulnerability shields protecting me. <laughs> Very good. I'm gonna move right over here. All right. Okay. Uh, so I guess the the Menengo's got a good turn. I guess some like End of a turn, new turn, yep. new turn, that's it. Is that Antius's body that's once again come to haunt us? <laughs> oh boy. Oh god. <laughs> no. It doesn't look like Antius. That, that's a shoot on sight situation. <laughs> <laughs> you guys created this No, zombie. he's, once he's dead, they stay it's dead. happened before. Back. No, no. <laughs> you brought him back. Yes, you brought him back. Yes, I brought back only once on the ship. We, that ship incinerated. I think we're good. That was a <laughs> legally off-brand answer. He was <laughs> off answer. He was missing his head. Right. Yeah. Couldn't quite tell. Yeah. So Norsk, um, Antius was uh, our was Yilmug's former character who uh, was on was squad leader on our second mission, and we had some war penalties. Also a captain somehow. Yeah. Uh, and and we had some warp entities uh, interfering with our comms, and he thought that he was being corrupted by the warp, so he threw his helmet off and shot himself in the head. It's because mostly because there was no will to save as, as whatever well. to resist anything. So I'm like, oh, if I don't can't even attempt to resist this, I'm corrupted. I have been invaded, and I will not stand for it. Yeah, and Boko was like, are you sure you want to kill your own character? And he was like, yes. Fuck it. No, but the thing was... I fuck it, stutter. Right, but it, the <laughs> thing was, it wasn't a psychic thing. It was literally manipulating the air to, to like, a... It was, it was he was hearing it through his comps. Yeah, he's hearing Which it Which I comps. took the helmet off and was still hearing it. Yeah. So. yeah. It can throw its voice, so you know it, it, it wasn't Valid. doing any psychic bullshit. So, was it... He just heard it. Like, oh crap. It was Valid. good. You should, you should watch that. It was a really good session. And then he committed I mean, bullet was, brain. Uh, my character was also on the path of becoming a chaplain, so... Not anymore, he's not. <laughs> yeah, it was just like, oh, well, if this is happening to me, I can't be that. Oops. I must do my duty as a space marine and end it. Very the fluff. Well, I was hoping your character would overcome... Come 
adversity, but he, he, he I guess if I had like a will save or something, I could have gone through with that. But it was just like, oh no, this is just happening. Well, yeah, all right. Yeah, I don't know. He overcame the adversity. Yeah, he did through sheer firepower. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He improvised, adapted, and overcame. All right, so uh, Dom and Nagos went. Is that the person above me? <laughs> I don't. I can't see who's what. Okay, uh, Brasaro, go. I did. I moved slightly. Okay, Karnoth. Uh, okay. Uh, the enemy is not doing anything, so I'm just gonna stand here and I'm gonna protect my sacred. Uh, Krom, go. I am turning 90 degrees to the left, and I am moving towards this goober. Okay. Which I go... I am going to... Just you have full sprint? Full sprint? Sure. Then re remember, your agility bonus is doubled, so your movement is effectively doubled. Oh, very cool. So you can yep. probably make it all the way up to him. Now, if you step uh, outside of that circle, the possibility shield, which is plus 10 on any... Yeah, it just means you stop getting the re-rolls on uh, the... From stuff, but the moment right. you get back into it, you're affected by it again. That's fair. So I can move. Let's see, thirty-six would be my normal move here. Charge. I'm just gonna move to here, which is well within the doubled for charge. Yep. Go well, for it. You would probably do a run then, because charge is a uh, you're immediately attacking with uh, a melee attack after it. Oh dear fucking gods! <laughs> I'm so really just... regretting. I'm re <laughs> I'm kind of regretting putting my sprite here. I'm kind of not. What, I don't. Where did you? I don't even see it. What? Where? Oh, I think he he's still hovering his character. <laughs> so, but now he sees oh. around the corner. Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah. With this run, <laughs> can I uh, say something real quick over the comms? Yeah. Grenades okay. now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's all I can do. Unless I can grab this dude and yank him around the corner. Um, he seems very dead set what he's doing. Uh, Neil Tyson, go. All right. I'm going to... Uh... I don't think you have 30 seconds to make another dud. <laughs> you don't. You don't. We don't have 30 seconds. We have five. Yeah, I'm not going to make another... Uh... Acid mine. That was way too many rolls that could have gone horribly wrong and did, for that matter. I'm the just gonna move closer called. here. That's my turn. Okay, uh, Eric, ladies, go. What a great time to have strong point. <laughs> <laughs> Is it too in cohesion? All right, I'm gonna yes, take please. a ten step here. Uh, that would be about right here. Fire and retreat on the move. We need to progress. All right. Oh, you're going the opposite direction. Yeah, I'm making sure I'm keeping y'all within possibility shield, but we do need to keep moving. Standing and fighting is just going to lead to our deaths. Right, so That's it a good is... Point. Grab him and retreat. It is their turn. We can use uh, this as a choke as we retreat. So... Let's see. He is going to fire at the guy shooting at him. Which is going to be this your... One. He's going to be shooting at your your guy. Yep, your boy. He hits him. Uh oh And hits him for 32 damage. Oh, holy shit. Pen With 30. the pen and 30, yikes. Where does it hit him? That's the head, uh, right? The, no, 65. That's... Body. Okay. So we had a survivor. He. Well, he's I mean, down. That's the strongest army we, point, so he yeah, could survive it. Yeah, had. Yeah, had yeah. Arm, yeah. yeah. He goes. He goes flat on the ground. Now, so. if he would, if he's a space marine, he should resist enough critical damage to where that might not kill him. If he has, like. What no, that it? would kill him. That would probably no. That's just a, no. I think he's, he's, he's not. Out, he's not out of right. PC. Well, he's not out dead. He's the, just. Uh, he's prone. The penetration oh. would ignore the armor, but it wouldn't add to the overall damage. Right. So. Right. So, right. But he's definitely out of wounds, and he's definitely in critical levels. Yes. Assuming he had his full health to begin with. 
He, he had full health. Okay. But he's definitely in crit levels now. And to the head, he's probably unconscious. Dragon. Yeah. Was not I to have the to wait until the whole next turn because I'm the only one up here. Okay, yeah. and the don't think you're in the range of the other one. So, the, but the other space marine sees you, and he's gonna take a shot at you. I'm hidden by a wall. Or should oh, be? you are. You are, aren't you? Okay. Yes, yeah. I'm. I was right behind him. I didn't go up past him. So, so how much critical how damage? Ten. That is the max. Ten plus. So he's at ten plus. Yeah, oh wait, no. I mean, like be... ten plus is is like death. I mean, uh, he took like probably twenty, like six critical damage if it's halved. So. Yep. Yeah. All right. He's so... not out. Yeah. Okay. And that's from that dread hot. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, Dominego, go. Uh, the Menango is gonna move. Uh, did you announce any strong points or like any uh, squad mode abilities, or just, did you just move, uh, your mug? I just moved. Okay. Uh, just, well, gonna... remember we all have you know double our movement. So oh, any half move true. is essentially a full move. I forgot about that. Uh, no, I'll move here. That's going to be my half move. And the rest of my half move, I'm going to uh, spend aiming down the hole. For any basically Overwatch, if you may. Uh, I think there's actually an actual thing. There is an actual do. Overwatch, yeah. I forgot if you're it's you're right next to him. How? F uh, so. Page two four one. It just be a strength check. You you can move your full distance. Go. Cool. Oh, it's a full action. Goddamn. Yeah. Uh, you'll then... just spend you'll spend a half action picking him up. And then that's fair. Okay, we could head into this room and then Overwatch in there. I'm gonna stand here and I'm gonna do Overwatch. Then I'm not gonna move. I'm just gonna stay in the place I was. I'm gonna spend a full action to aim, uh, Overwatch. Okay. Sorry, you already went. No, I didn't. Oh. Okay, so Dominego. Okay, yeah, yeah. Brasora, go. Sorry, that was Dominego. Sorry, I'm confused because because he has two characters. All right, Brasora, go. Yeah, yeah. That's so going to be a full auto burst, I guess, because you need to declare what kind of action you're going to do. <clears throat> I think when preparing an action, though, you can only like prepare a half action. Hmm. Ah. Oh, and you use your reaction right to trigger it, too. Hey, normal hey. move. Ah, 14. Now. Well, shit. Yeah, we got trouble inside the room, too. Another bunch of people over here. One of them looks quite large. Yeah, as you look at him, he looks like he's, uh... Like he's mutated. He's hulking. His, uh, space marine armor barely torches around him. And he's holding up what looks to appear to be a fairly large cannon. Is it another one of those void horror rifles? No. Okay. Uh, that's that other. That's that other group. These guys are. Not, they, they don't have that. Ah.
Uh, what did you say again? It was like a. a oh, actually, never mind. Never mind. Fairly large cannon. He's holding. Okay, are you done? Um. I, mean, I can move and fire as part of a full round action, but it's not going to do anything to them. Okay, so you're going to back off and get in cover, and then uh, wait wait for someone else? Uh, yes, sort of. I was going to pull my jetpack and just zip up over here. <laughs> what time? Just saw a little thing just go ink. A, f a full 180. Damn. Yeah, nope. the ele yeah, the elevator's that way. Down Which the way? South. South? south. Yeah, yeah. I am going to let everybody know there's a bunch of people in that room, including a dude with a very heavy weapon. A bunch of people? Uh, four people, one with a very large weapon. He's also hulking in size, I'd imagine. We Looks like he's not size. fitting in it. He doesn't fit in his armor anymore. Oh. Right. He's mutated to hell. <laughs> and he's he's about, I don't know, 12 feet high or more, you'd say? Yeah. If you were to guesstimate. It's like a Bigfoot in armor. <laughs> okay, Karnoth, go. All right. Can I? Okay. Uh, can I fly up and pick up the down space marine and fly back? I was, uh, yeah. Dude, I was, it's gonna be a pilot check. I was planning yeah. on running over there and uh, hoisting him up over my shoulder with the mechanicus oh. arm. But I think, uh, Krom was gonna do all that. I'm standing right next to him. Yeah. Yeah. So it makes yeah. sense. So it's up to you how you guys want to coordinate. I'm probably gonna uh, back up, uh, from yeah i can I at know. least i can do what just a regular uh full move uh once i've picked him up which means half, i can get him to half action to pick him up like fireman carry i know. can move a long distance okay so you're gonna you, you're gonna go over there to back him up or like uh besides karnoff has a personal reason to do that so he would Ooh, do that regardless okay. of what you do that's true all right uh just I guess two pilot checks, one to get there, and then half action to pick him up. Uh, all right, so let's see. So, how far can move with the half action used? So. I, basically, I can move here, and yes, I can move back. That's within my movement uh, thing. So, okay. uh, let me so see. Holy two, pilot, two pilot checks, minus 30. Pilot checks, minus 30. Also. You did use a, you did use my pilot. Oh, you didn't use my fate uh, fuck fate points. Uh, uh, death, right? You used one fate point on the making on the ash yes. grenade thing. Okay. Uh, where is pilot? Oh, there you go. I am so glad. Uh, did you say minus thirty? Minus thirty. Yeah. So it's two pilot checks. You need one to get, get plus there. ten on at least one of them. The first yep. one. First one, zero. I passed hey, that. Oh, sorry. That should be the shield for the win. Karnoff. Uh, and the, so basically, I get up to him, and I pick him up. Is, is that the first one? Half action, yep. You get to okay, him, then, and then I spend a half action to pick him up. And then another one is going to be at the minus 10. And I pick him up. As, like, I Damn. basically, uh, Karnoff's uh, jump pack revs up. He... Dashes in like at, uh, at astonishing speed, uh, <laughs> because not only is he's naturally fast because of his augmentations made by uh, Neo Tyson, but also because he's being blessed by Brisora, uh, and he as a as excuse a, me, you're being blessed by the Emperor. Uh, oh yeah, true. The Can Emperor you, protects. Right. <laughs> 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 the Emperor <laughs> protects <laughs> brothers. <laughs> <laughs> and he basically in a in a whim he flies back with a, a down space marine basically in hand gg emperor bless all right 
Uh, so that's your turn, so Krom, go. Well, there's no need for me to stay in my happy ass here anymore. Oh, you don't uh, want to stay and watch the, the fireworks? <laughs> as as I'd love to, no. He will become the fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I don't, if I had grenades, it'd be a different story. All right, so I can get my happy butt up to about here. Yeah, if you do, gonna do a run or charge. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do a run. Are you telling them what what's coming this way? Yes. Uh, that is... Two Dreadnoughts. Contemptor Dreadnought? Looks like a Contemptor and a Demolisher. Ooh. Oh. Uh -oh. There is there is at least one Contemptor and a, a mass behind it that I cannot make up. It's, yeah, it would be the same one. Okay, so two Contemptors and a Devastator. I'm going to go to... And a full squad of Marines behind those guys. Ooh. Those I can't see. Yeah, that was that party these guys were thinking about attacking. I'm going to back up to about. about here, which should let yeah. me take some fire if they need to so they can dip in. By the way, that that guy who we just rescued, he got hit in the head, right? That is Sergeant Fallows. Yes. He, he took, like, his chest armor is all gone. He just, where there was, mm. where there was armor, you just see a giant hole. Yeah. It if I had Medicaid ability, damage. I would use Medicaid ability. <laughs> well, I'm, yeah, we I'm, should have armor patch kits. I'm thinking he would have to roll on the critical table, right? Uh, you don't roll on the crit table. You just count how much wounds you have once it was applied. And then yeah, that's just so what you're at. And right. then the next time you're damaged, that's the new value in addition to what happened last time. Right. Yeah, so if we, if we presume he has an average of 20 wounds, then he would be at 6 critical damage. Yep. Right. Is that almost lethal? Yes. Yeah, like 10 plus is if, lethal. Like, like, no, I think 7 plus, uh, depending on the, the place it eight, is, 7 plus can be lethal. Plus. Oh, yeah, yeah, true. Because, like, for the head, it's 7 plus. But I think you just said it was 8. So he's, like, you know, 2 away from dead. We need to move so, now. So, uh... Him. Sorry. Go ahead. Oh, that was, that was what I was saying in character. Got it. So, this is out of character. That warp fire cannon, we need to know what type of damage that was. I think it's energy. You can predict much say it's energy. Energy? But yeah. Pretty yeah, sure energy. warp fire is energy. Alright, so it should be energy critical effects body... This is why I don't. It's NPC. Don't worry about it. He's unconscious. Oh, okay. Yeah. Too much. Got it. So, then I'll have to do that for all the NPCs that you guys. Oh with. yeah. All right. So, like, for simplicity's sake, I'll treat him somewhat like a player. He's unconscious. Gotcha. So Neil Tyson, go. Uh. Yes. If you want to pick him up. I can pro I can give it to you. Why why is he picking him up? No, because like he proposed that he can hold him by with his mechanical arm. Yeah, he could probably carry him with his mechanical arm just fine. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah easily. Yep, that would be me. And yeah, so I I effortlessly uh use my uh what would that be? That's my it started servo arm to uh Pick this guy up and hoist him over my shoulder. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's your half action? Okay, so yeah. what else are you doing? So well, I'm going to carry him to safety. So you used a half action to pick him up. So. Yep. And yeah, then. Half action to move. Yeah, yeah so up. I'm going to be moving. I'm going to be moving this way because that's away from all the bullshit. Yeah, and it's doubled because of double you know, agility bonus. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Do we have anyone else in this room? Yes. Yeah, right over a here. A group of people and a really large guy with a big gun. Very well. Yeah, we gotta get through them. But the elevator's awesome in here. Somewhere. Avoid the acid puddle, brothers. <laughs> the one that has Eric? some melted chaos marines in it. Uh, Eric, ladies, go. Let's hurry it up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
And I'll mark, <laughs> yeah, I'll mark where the uh, elevator shaft is for you guys. <clears throat> We can't see it on the map, but if you ping it, then yeah, maybe so we can. You, you, you know generally where it's at. You guys don't see oh, it Oh, bottom. Yet. I see. At the bottom. Okay. Uh, and then you're done, Eric Ladies? Yep. Because it's a half action to maintain and a half action to move. Okay. Let me go see how far these fucking things can move. And then once we can finally get to a position where we can all benefit from it, I can drop it, and we can run like hell. Okay. So they can... Oh, you don't want to stay and fight? The Hell no, that's probably, two fucking dreadnoughts. We could probably pull out these guys, but I, you know. I'm pretty sure those were, were contemptors. They're not contemptors. Oh, yeah, we're not, we're not fighting the contemptors, but we might have to spend, like, a round clearing out some of these guys and then just booking it. Yeah. Okay. And then, can these... Oh, this space marine can—he can't see you. Let's see who can he see. None of us. Uh, yeah, he can't see nobody. Yeah. So there's a corner but, there. But they—they they know you're and, yeah. there. Oh, they knew we were there when we blew up their friends. Yeah, I yeah. think the grenade might have given that away. Yeah, so, and the boulder shots as well. Yeah. Yep. Nah, so, that probably sounded like normal. Mm -hmm. So they're taking up positions. Uh, uh, worst comes to worst, YOLO. Don't yep. do that. Dominagos, go. Wait, did that did that guy enter while I was being um overwatched? Yeah. Uh, and then oh, if he there's a if this guy on the top enters behind the wall. Oh, yeah, did, did, did right the, I think Domenico saw him, right? Or no? Maybe. I'm, in, I'm essentially covering the whole corridor. Can he... He's within line of sight. Oh, okay. yeah. So that would be line of sight. Because he just absolutely. pulled Okay. So go ahead and do your thing. All righty. Uh, bada bing, bada boom. That's going to be about this much. Yeah, I think he's pretty dead. Yeah. <laughs> 55 torso though. All right. Uh, he has an AP of 44, right? On the torso. Armor points of 44. Let me check what they got. Uh, I will let you know that Overwatch uh, does give you a minus two to your ballistic skill. 44. Yep. 44. Minus two. Okay. So that's going to be. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh, yes, that's true. Minus two or minus 20? Minus 20. Okay. So it's a. Two degrees of success minus that. Yep. Yeah, it'd be really weird if it was only a minus two penalty for Overwatch. <laughs> but did he use my plus 10 for a possibility shield? Not yet. Definitely want to save that for a damage roll. I mean, you could. So, what's the armor on the chest? 44. 44, okay. Oh, Thank if it's going to the chest, yeah, yeah, see if that for a damage roll. All right, I'm going to do the, wow, that was the one the one before the last one, so that's going to be 10 damage he's going to get. Okay, so that's at least something. Something something got through. That was that was during the enemy's turn, by the way. Yep. Yep. Uh, and then now Domenego is going to do a, let's see here. Movement, half move, let's see. No, he can't. Can you do a half action to shoot and then move? Yes. Okay. Uh, uh, it is a single shot. Yes. Yeah. Single shot, half action, and then uh, half action to move. He can do that because he has the talent. All right. It's going to be about this much, I think, to hit. That's going to be hit. one attack. 43. Okay. Uh, Sounds like chest. It is. <laughs> 35, uh, 34. Set her right. mass. It's a bad right. idea. You didn't use possibility shield yet. 
but that's the damage he would have done uh with the i don't think he would have done any damage to be honest yeah it bounces off well, even with the plus 10 it's nothing and then he's gonna move over to cover and over here so why does this one that shot only have a plus seven penetrate or a seven penetration and the other shot oh, had that, 11. so that's a just inbuilt uh shot of uh, that row 20 has and uh his bolter uh acts he has increased penetration if the armor of the target is more than 11 or 10 i forgot which one it was but uh well, which it definitely is yeah <laughs> yes so he would have had 11 penetration but even then still that wouldn't have done any damage wait a minute what? why is why is that uh roll table have all negative numbers in it well, that's because it's, it didn't do enough damage to get penetrate armor. armor oh okay i see interesting yeah yeah, Macro. But with a roll of a two and a one, even with plus ten, yeah, that's twenty-eight plus additional four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not enough. Hey. I would need to roll like a, a nine on both, or like to even be like yeah. nine and ten to even do one you, damage. You need you need two nines to do one damage. Yeah. Yep. Because that zero was a nine and an eight. Yes. No, that was nine and nine. Eight yeah, the day was replaced by the. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, all right. Yes, yeah, so you need a nine and a ten. At least you got got ten damage into that guy. Yeah, the blessed okay. shot of the emperor, Gath Yes. Yep. Uh, is he done? Uh, you mean the psychic powers of me? <laughs> that that's the end. Uh, thank you. Yes. Yep. Emperor sorry, go. Oh, well, I can move and shoot, so. You can walk and chew gum at the same time? Wow. Yes. <laughs> Fancy. I can oh, do that too, but less than- Oh my here. god, wow. How did you do that? What? Like you just like moved from one point and then to another point. And like in a sweet animation. Yeah. Like you made a- Oh, the lion just shit. zipped me. Yeah, he's walking yeah. and chewing gum at the same time. We anyway, already established going this. here, shooting this guy, then moving on to the corner over there once I'm done yeah, shooting. Sounds, him. sounds good. Oh, you don't want to go to that corner and meet some friends? <laughs> no, I'm going to the corner after I shoot this guy. Oh, okay. I meant, like, out there where he's he at. Met, he meant the oh, corner no, 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 I'm no. looking at. The, the bad corner. Yeah. <laughs> I'm in range of him, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, okay. This this isn't plus anything. It's not aiming or anything like that. Hey, okay. what do you hit? Uh, head. Oh my Hi. god! Oh man! Oh, he... sorry. That sorry. That was the wrong damage roll. Oh god! Yeah, he's dead. Not that. Took his head off. Would you like to describe how you killed this guy? Yeah, please um, do. His head melts and he falls down backwards. <laughs> nice. Surprised you didn't say he, uh, like, falls into the ground and pulls the trigger. Turn off, go. He died of old age. Alright, seeing so now that I passed the... Now that new Tyson picked up the guy, I also overheard that there are... Yep. Multiple bad guys over in that direction, so I'm just gonna. Uh, oh, I can see one right here. Yep, he's in cover. Oh, yes. Actually, I think I can actually see him as well. Luckily, I'm barely in cover from him as well, I think. So this is gonna be a 76. How are you? Should I, though? Mm. There, considering there's a dude um, right yeah, here, probably, probably right probably here, shooters. and a big guy with a cannon right there. 
54. Someone has to take away their attention. Uh, yes. Is this uh, going to be... Is this cover? Is this technically cover? Yeah. All right. 60. I can just... Actually, I can just run, run up to it without even engaging my jetpack. Yunk. Would this put me within range of them? This little marker? Uh, yes, I would. But now, would you're practically in the open. No, you're not. You're far. Very well. One here, one here, one here, one here. Bad moment to not have a gun. Oh, barely all the way. I'm going to hit him uh, with my stick. Take the gun yeah, off your uh, unconscious buddy. Also true. Uh, I'm going to be basically standing in this cover. I'm going to be uh, shooed up and just waiting for them to... They saw me get in there, so maybe they would do something. Um, end my turn. Okay. Uh, yeah, they definitely like Crom, go. All right, I can move. I got that double movement fun stuff again. Which first and foremost, so I just being in their location for everyone to know. I mean, you guys are calling him out as soon as you see him. Yep. Yeah. How did you do the hang? On, how did you do the snap movement things to figure out all of your distances? So you oh. click on the ruler tool. Yeah. Okay. Oh, sorry. No. Uh, click your character, drag them, and then hold right mouse button, and it should come up with a line. Mm. Hold left click and uh, click right click. Okay. Very well. I was kind of wondering about that. Oh my goodness. So right now, if I charge, I can do 27 times 2 is 54. I'm assuming you're going to go to cover immediately, right? Well, I'm at least going to here. This does have cover, by the way. Where you're going to, it, yeah. it does have Right here, cover. that is... 27, so that's half. That way, if I charge, that would be half of charge. I'm just doing... You can run. You can just run. That's you fair. can use the run. Yeah. Well, if I'm just going to run, I'm just going to go straight to it. Damn it. There we go. Yeah, I can run to that. I'm going to run to here with my shield up. Make a dice Are roll you... when it's their turn to see who they who this guy attacks. <laughs> Are these barrow? Uh, are these barrels a space marine height? Uh, like um, um, tall or how how They're tall about, are these? About, about to your waist. Oh. So you're gonna have to right. kneel kneel down to get the cover full cover benefits. Oh Jesus. Neil, what? Who said my name? <laughs> and in fact, it's your turn. Oh. I'm sure you're done, Rom. I don't. Right. I don't think I can do anything else after having ran. Yes. So I'm going to, still carrying this unconscious guy, uh, I'm basically just trying to match pace with Ericlades right now. So I'm moving into this corner, and I'm just looking over my back shoulder to uh, make sure that we're not being followed. That's hey. where I'm going. Ericlades, go. Sweet. I'm going to throw a smite. Downrange at this guy. <clears throat> uh, and it's going to be unfettered. Ooh. All right. I hit him. It was not a double, so I don't have to roll on the table. And then I do 66 damage. Yeah, uh, he's dead. He's like mega dead. Oh, shit. 40. Plus the I 10 uh, from my possibility I shield. I, on think, the roll. I think even if you hit him dead center chest and that took it, he'd still be dead. It's 66. Dead center chest, he'd only take 6 damage. No, he said he said 6 D. 10? No, 66. Wait, 60, 60, 60, 60, 60, 10. 10. Well, uh, 
Yeah, it's a it's a pin of six. Okay. And the hit roll was for seventy five, wherever that location is. Fifty seven uh, chest. Seventy five is chest. Yep. Cool. So the total damage I did was fifty. Uh, seventy five is six. left. Is right, right leg. leg or right leg? Yeah. No, okay. Right. Wait. That's not. He's the, yeah. He, I rolled a, I you, rolled a you reverse, guys. You reverse and you rolled a fifty-seven. Yeah, I rolled a fifty-seven. Okay, I thought you said you rolled a seventy-five. No, no, and I rolled a fifty-seven, so the location is seventy-five. Gotcha. I, I think you got what is that? What is that called again? When you get a ten, um, righteous fury. Righteous fury. Go ahead, and do it. Keep doing it until you fail, I guess. Well, I mean, he's already dead, so. Okay. Well, I want to see how dead he was going to be. Oh darn. Well, okay. if my powers could go further, then maybe I would have, but All right. don't. It's their turn, and I'm going to roll a dice and see who. So I'm going to roll 1d6. Uh, evens, it attacks you, Crom. Odds, it attacks the other guy. Very well. Even. Please Krom. be me. Please be me. Oh. Okay. So he's going to move here. Remember, you can roll dodge twice and get the better result. And he, you also have the protection power field around you. So you can at least take one shot. Maybe. Right. And Because that's just... a 50% chance you hit to maybe. <laughs> right. And was it plus 20 at this range? Yeah. Did he hit? He hits and deals damage. Yeah, he'll survive that, right? 46. I don't know how to apply that, so I have no idea. 46 is chest piece, so what's the armor on your chest? 14. Plus whatever I'd have, I'd have for my shield. Minus uh, 10. The, bottom, the number at the bottom. Oh, your 29. Number? 29. That's without any shield plus minus, fours, whatever you're talking about. Minus 10, so 19, so you take one damage. Yeah, just suck it. <laughs> yeah. I have a shield up, so I don't really care. Hee hee hee, that tickles. Oh, if, it's right. a power shield, if it's a power shield, you have the ability to possibly ignore it. But uh, I mean, it is. I mean, yeah, he rolled shield. so bad on damage. That the boarding is, shields yes. aren't powered. They shield. are powered. Oh, they are they power have, shields. They have the generators. Yeah, they're bigger versions. Okay. Uh, then you can roll a D100, and if it's under 50 or 45, I think, for boarding shields. 50 for him. It is 50. Yeah. So if it roll a D100, if it's under 50, no, you took it. Okay. So we yeah, one damage. Okay. I have uh, no clue how the shields worked. So power shields is you just roll a D100 after you get hit for every hit, and if it's 50 or below, you don't take any damage whatsoever. So but if the rolls, uh, I think for boarding shield it might be 10 and lower. Most likely, yeah. Oh god, I'd have, to, I'd have to look it up, but. Uh, it's like 10 or lower or 5 or lower for boarding shields. If you roll that, you negate the hit, but then your shield stops working. Right. So, yeah, this guy runs up to you and brings out his chain sword and brings it down on top of you, and you just deflect it with your shield, and it goes bouncing off harmlessly. Ah, oh, very well. He is, can, you, he is, can you take your free I, action to uh, I, uh, counterattack? Does he have counter? Does he have that ability? I have counterattack and wall of steel. Okay, counterattack. Uh, uh, I think it's only if you successfully parry. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. parry it very well. He missed. Yeah. So. Oh, uh, yeah. right. No need Doesn't to. No, but. Mm, no, 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 no. What were you gonna say? <laughs> Can he parry still? I don't think so. Let me check. I, mean, I think it, you can only parry if the hit's going to hit you. That's what I was, yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, but he failed. He got a 92, so... You're, yeah, so basically, oh, yeah. basically counter attack works is that if the attack succeeds against you and you successfully parry it after those two conditions are met, you can yeah. then follow up and hit the person. Yes. If they just miss, you really can't do much. I would just imagine that this guy... Does a swing and a miss, and then he drops his chain sword on the ground, and the teeth act like treads, and it just scurries have away. You seen the, have you seen <laughs> the Pariah video from Warhammer Plus with the Ultramarine uh, Sergeant and oh. the Necron? Uh -oh. Yeah, Long where he comes ago. around. That's that's against both y'all. He the the other Space Marine back here. Where did the, where did he eat? That's his a ridiculously grenade? good crack grenade compared to what oh. you guys have been throwing. Yep, That's he tossed true. he tossed it at you. Very well. 
and his buddy's gonna eat that too. So I'm gonna that to dodge well, the good news is, is you can dodge this. I'm gonna try uh, because the area radius for a Krakenade isn't large. Where am I going to dodge? Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay. It, uh, dodge is just a. Is it an actual skill? Yeah, yeah it is I remember a it's it's a it's a skill. You roll it. Hey, you there succeeded. You and well, then that, you that was dodge. the ice marine. Thing. Your agility bonus in distance, which is now doubled, plus whatever you degrees of success you had. Yeah, the chaos space marine dodged that. So here you go. So hang on, because you're all talking at the same time. So it's dodge with what and what and what and what. So you make a dodge roll. Okay. Uh, and if you succeed. I'm just you making dodge. a dodge roll. I don't know what how to, I'm trying to figure out how to add all the multipliers and stuff because I'm not used to the electronic version is what right, I'm trying to say. There's, there's no modifiers there, so you're, you're good. You you made your dodge roll. So now you get to dodge a number of meters equals to your agility bonus, which is currently doubled because of Asura's prayer. Um, so you can move that many meters away. And if you end up outside of the radius of the explosion, you don't get hit. Crack grenades... Radius of explosions are one meter, so as long as you move at least one meter away, you're good. This was yep. a chaos Krakenade, so it might be a bit bigger than that. All right, then maybe two meters. It's the same. It right. just does more. It just does more damage. Yeah, but you essentially right now have uh, a full free, uh, full move, or a half move, if it doubles. Half, half move doubled. Yeah, that you can just do right now. Okay. <laughs> As long as you end outside of a meter from wherever that crack grenade exploded from. Which I'm presuming it was centered on where I was. I don't like those things that you're moving back there, Foco. No one you can did. just move them back. They've they've lost track of us. They're not following us anymore. Yeah, we shouldn't um, really they're, do not, that. they're not going to follow the explosions or the gunfire or the, their fellow men calming them. No, no, no. They, they, they can smell the acid pool and they're like, we don't want any of that. And yeah, there's yeah, yeah. chaos shit happening, happening over there. We don't want any of it. Yeah, okay. Hey, uh, we had a malfunction. Um, it's all fine here. Uh, we're fine now. Thanks. How are you? <laughs> yeah. mm, yes, indeed. All right. No, over open comps that gets transmitted. Uh, what, what's that timer symbol on the big guy? He's reloading. He, I'm he reloading. He gets one shot and he has takes two turns to reload. So you're good. Oh well. Oh dead. damn. Yeah, he's fucking dead. That was like damn. All that preparation for this guy. And he blows his load and fails. So you just see this giant guy go. I'm going to say now, we should take this turn to book it as fast as we can. Man, first the Hermagons jizzing from their weapons, and now this guy blew his load. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> yeah, he blew his load. And it failed. He rolled like the worst possible roll. He rolled a one on damage. No one's going uh, to get pregnant with that load. Domenango is going to do a cold shot, which means he's going to take a minus 20 on his penalty to hit. Okay. But he can choose the location of the hit. Okay. And you're choosing the big guy? I'm going to choose... Yeah, I'm going to choose the big guy. I hit. But that's going to be only, I think, one attack I can do. Oh, you rolled I... a one! Yeah, Holy because I... Holy shit! Um, let me see. I'm going gonna... to do two attacks, because that's how the macro allows yep. you only to do up to two attacks. But uh, it should only count the first one uh, with the damage. So what's his armor on the head? I'm going to aim for his head. Uh, let's see. It's... It's the same as the other guys, because it's essentially just a uh, in Lord. 24. Version. Okay. Yeah. I mean, yeah, even yeah. if you weren't calling the shot, you hit his head 24. regardless. Yeah, 24 armor on the head. So the first shot, 17, and I would like to add the possibility to shield damage to it. So it's going to be 27 okay. with, with a pen of 11. Pen of 11. Oh, I mean, as in like that, that's the... Oh, sorry, that's 27 is all the damage he takes, like already after all the, all the armor. Okay, so minus 27. Yeah, he's still up. He just looks really, really hurt, really Ooh. pissed at you. You do have a uh, Righteous Fury. I only took uh, concern no, the, the first, first shot. The second one wasn't a roll. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Second one's ignored. He'd, he'd, be gotcha. dead with all, he'd be dead with all that. 
uh, end of my turn. Okay, for Sora, go. Alrighty. Oh, how crazy do I want to be today? Um, insane. Not that crazy. <laughs> if I'm going insane, then hello. Let's jet back over here and shoot this guy in the back. <laughs> Granted, I am moving and shooting, so with a huge jetpack bones so that's gonna probably be a pilot roll i'd imagine before going around going, corners. Gonna leave i'd imagine so yeah to yep. the just give me one marine in the back yes i think i made that yep Oh, nice. Right. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> Buy is right. All right, where is 26? Uh, left arm. 26 is, yes. Yeah, he's not, yeah, four, 41. He only had like 10 health left. So, Damn, I'm, about to, I'm about to beat the shit out of someone with a fucking spear. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Karnoth, go. All right, Karnoth's turn. Let's see. Uh, I'm just looking at North's camera right now, and after he said he's going to beat the shit out of someone <laughs> with the spear, he's, like, cracking all his knuckles. Uh, Let's yeah, do yeah, this. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's been looking forward to this. Someone came out with melee. He's like, oh, hell yeah. Like, yes! Crack some skulls <laughs> open. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna use my actually don't yeah, I'm gonna just run up to the the space marine and I'm gonna do a charge move. Okay. Oh man, all of a sudden I can't see anything anymore because <laughs> You don't need to see anything, just move. Well, because I've shared vision with Karnoff for some reason, but not uh, yeah, anyone you're else. Technically controlling me. You'd controlled me before, you have yeah. Like, oh, yeah, oh man, that's weird. Feet. I still have vision of uh, Gopher's character, too. I'll say, brothers, you are clear. Move. <laughs> but yeah, Karnoth moved and it just oh. obscured oh. everything behind him. That's a, that's <laughs> that a hundred. That's a hundred. That's a oh, miss. Oh, man. That's Even a very a, big miss. That's uh, really bad. Do you want a fade point for that? Yeah, I don't think you want your Blade of the Black Shields to explode in your hands. Are you, are you sure he missed? Yeah. He got 2.6 <laughs> degrees of success. He rolled a 100, <laughs> man. That doesn't mean he auto fails. I don't know. Yeah, That's up to the GM. 100 would be hit on the left leg, right? Yeah, I think head, I think. Actually. How, how do you succeed? Mm, head is one that Oh, no, double zero is what, left leg. Yeah. This game doesn't use auto failure or auto succeeds. Hmm. Yeah, it uses degrees of success. So Yeah, and he got two degrees of success even yeah. with rolling a 100. So he hits with two Good degrees Lord. of success. What so, the fuck? But bad things could happen at 100. Yeah, I'd sure? imagine. I mean, sure. I mean, that is a GM decision, but... Yeah. As, as far so, as this game goes, there's no rule that says auto bad things happen at 100 or auto good things happen at ones. Yeah, but the it GM is purely could have house based rules. off of... Yeah, yeah I know, uh, what, what, The game that? sets are... Purely based on degrees of success is to determine how good or bad something happens. Well, but, you, you know, you, GM you, GMs. You hit, yeah, yeah. You hit him with a blade, right? I did hit him with a blade, correct. What kind of blade is it? The Blade of the Black Shields. Which is the, the one energy, I had. energy weapon or whatever? It's a tearing weapon. Okay. It, it's the double-handed chain blade, isn't it? Uh, it is, but uh, this, uh, Neo Tyson modified it to be retractable, to be one-handed. And I'm currently using ah, it in right. one-handed mode. Up, along okay. with my shield in the other hand. All right. Dan is suffering from success well, currently. It, well, yeah. Do your damage and all that stuff. Uh, it's gonna get stuck in him. You have Very to, well. You have to spend a half action to pull out. Could be worse. <laughs> Turbogons yeah. have exploded at higher rolls. 
Uh, where am I hitting <laughs> yeah. him? Oh, that's uh, leg, right? A uh, left leg. So that's going to be also 24 uh, armor on his leg. <laughs> All right. Yep. Uh, oh. Everything is 24 and the legs are the weakest, I believe. Let me check. God, on that first mission we fought the Tyranids, there were so many oh. Termagants and Hermagants that just killed themselves when they tried to attack us. Yeah. I rolled a and, 91, Gabo. And, and yeah. I was, uh, <laughs> during that, I was frenzied, and I shot... I think I uh, was fighting a, a warrior, a during warrior, and then my blade uh, got shoved away. Uh, it flew away out of my hand. And, and so didn't then... Pick it up. That was me, and, and actually. I, I couldn't I, pick I it up. Blade no, you, you also did that, yes. But, like, after that... Uh, my my blade th flew out of my hands, and then Yulmak's character, and I, I wasn't frenzy, so I could not go to that blade because I had to attack the first thing I saw. So <laughs> Yulmak's character had to go and pick it up and then toss it back to me, and I had to catch it. I yeah, I remember that. Roll. Yeah. And if you failed uh, catching it, you would have caught it with your face. Most likely, uh, Boko. So what's the leg armor on the? Twenty-four. Like the rest 24. of the Twenty-four. So that deals 17 damage to him. Ah, uh, he is hurt pretty bad. It went in pretty deep. Good. That's what she said. She chop his leg off? No. Not yet. Okay. No, about half, about halfway. He's got a chainsaw blade just stuck revving in this guy's Problem. leg right now. Go. It slipped away. I can't. I'm, cut. I'm well, it stopped roll. revving. As soon as it went in, it stopped revving immediately. I'm um. going to be lightning attacking and trying to hit this dude three times. Sweet. Uh. You want me to do three hit rolls? Yes. Uh, do, 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 do. do your damage. Uh, does he have a reaction to parry or like uh, dodge or something? Oh, he right. does. All right. Yeah, yeah. Let me do. Let me. Let me see. I'm not sure, but I don't think you can dodge out of melee. Uh, you can. Hey, I'm. He can, he can parry, but he failed. Hey, okay. well, he has nothing to parry with. He just has fists. <laughs> He's a gun, right? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't have a gun. Oh. Oh, he only has fists. Why is All this right. guy here? Uh. He's dead. <laughs> I want to describe this if you don't mind, sir. Yeah, go for it. So, in my right hand, I have my shield, and it just comes up behind him, and I just start stabbing him with a spear. Th uh, with the shield holding him up against me and the spear until he's dead. Brutal. Just continual thrust. <laughs> just thrust, thrust, and the third one just comes up into his, uh, underneath his throat through his helmet. Mm, warp shift Boom, out. out the top of his head. Neil yes. Tyson. Yep, Neil Tyson, go. Um, having just uh, witnessed that glorious death, uh, I'm... Let's see. Can we I give do... our enemies glorious deaths? We should be moving. Yeah, we should be moving. And yes. I'm just uh, gonna... Here's the elevator, right? Or if it was like, oh, somewhere over here. That's so I'm going to do my... What is it? It uh... was sound. Yes. Somewhere down over there. Should... I'm going to do... I could barely see it right there. Yeah. I'm going to move to the edge of the possibility shield. And when you get the elevator, we'll cut it there because I got better practice. All right. Oh, sorry, All right. I'm about to drop the possibility shield and just book it. So just book it. All right, fuck it. So the elevator shaft is on the other side of this this guy, right? No. Like south. Here? South. Oh, south. South. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna book it south then, and this is. Uh, I would assume I can still charge, but not do a run. Uh, just do the run. Yeah, the run is faster. Or you move further. Well, I'm also being weighed down. He's carrying They're strong. both full yeah. actions. Oh, okay. Oh. Well, I'm just oh, going to book it then. So, yeah, so you guys got at least two turns until one of those guys is in the hallway ready to fire at y'all. Oh, I see it. Okay. So you got at least two turns, but you'll probably be out of the elevator by then. They're slow. They are only move 30. And Oh, he's gone. Six, seven, eight, nine, nine. 
Yep, Oak is gone. What's that? Oh, never oh, mind. You left you for got, a second. You cut off, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut off. So, Neil, no, yeah, Neil's had some went. Okay, uh, Eric Lady's go. Sorry. Sweet. We just. Alright, cool. You just want to get the hell out of the dodge, huh? Boom, and I've dropped my uh, possibility shield. Okay. Let's go, brothers. Okay, bad guy's turn. He, he's going to counterattack you with his chainsaw. Did you hit him? He can definitely try. <laughs> right. Your weapon is stuck, so you can't parry him, can you? I have a shield. He's got a good. shield. Ah, better. And, and, and he, he missed goes, anyway. No, he goes to attack you, and his chainsaw just breaks on your armor in half. Oof. Yep. And it stops immediately, just breaks on top of you. Okay. And better over oil than under oil your weapon. Do you have a, a s combat or a storm shield? I'm actually curious. I have a storm shield. Very well. I wouldn't worry about him. He won't survive the round to you anyway. Yeah, you can just book it. And Dominicus, go. I think the fastest way for me is through you. Mm. I don't think I'd fit through that. Yeah, you can. Local. Okay. Yeah. Well, I can imagine you could. Yeah, yeah you, you can jump over. They're just, they're just a handful just of crates. crates. Okay, yeah. I didn't, I, I didn't know. It, it was looking like it was kind of compact. I was thinking like. No, the the I one, don't... the one next to you is a really big freight freight container. The one in front of you that you just pointed at, that's like a smaller crate. Okay. About chest, chest high, your guy can easily just hop up up it. Okay. Very well. I'll just move somewhere over here. There you go. End my turn. Dominico just ran. Okay, uh, Brasora, go. Oh. I'll be running and gunning this time, too, so that was a jetpack over here. Okay, so you're going to be shooting this guy? Yep. Just to clear the way? Yep. And you're shooting into combat, so what was it, minus 10? Uh, if you're shooting into melee range, it is, I think, minus 20. I do not have a minus on these pistols with that. Pray for talents. Uh, all right. They, yeah, they work in melee just fine normally. Oh, okay. Yeah, pistols, yeah, yeah. pistols do. Yes, pistols do. That's right. Yeah, you're good then. Do your thing. Oh, I'm going to point that. Whoops. Oh, darn. I would have loved to roleplay that. Okay, uh, he's, he's gonna get dead. 55 chest, by the way. Yeah, he, chest, yes. 55 chest? Yep. Yeah, he's mega dead. He only had two hit points, so. Oh. Or three. I think you did more than three points, right? Uh, yeah. yeah. 20 penetration. Okay. Karnoff, right, go. The rest of the movement. Uh, I gently yeah. pick up my sword, and oh, yeah. I book it. Yeah, finish your movement, Moth, sorry. And I'm done. Okay. Oh, right back here, actually. Okay, and Crom, go. Wait, uh, hold on. I need to make my movement first. Oh, oh, did you not do it? Okay, sorry. Uh, yes. Uh, I'd say you can probably jetpack that. I'll just move. Oh, oh I see oh. the elevator now. It's right here. I don't Sweet. need to use my fuel yet. Yeah, true. Haha, <laughs> fuel jetpacks. Get fusion already. <laughs> oh, yeah? But can they hey. give you a plus 30 on dodge? One second. Neil Tyson. Or Chrom go, sorry. sorry. Yeah, I had to reload. It wasn't letting me actually see my movements. Yeah, Chrom go and then Neil Tyson. Why is it not letting me actually do this? It's moving the whole screen around. Let me see my movement. That's not what I'm... 
Why is it doing that? No idea. I guess I can't. it can just do it for you. Yeah, it's not letting me do that. And I okay, okay. Select your character token, hold it to move it around, then right click. And then just keep holding left mouse. Uh, I am, but it's moving the whole screen around. I, I had that issue. I think I started press reloading at some point. I don't remember how I solved it, but I don't know. Um, uh, I can move to right here. Boom. Sweet. Right. Heracles, go. I'm going to move. There. And that's my turn. And uh, uh, everyone moved, right? Uh, I think you skipped our tech marine. Yep. Did he? Get yeah, I, I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be moving. Yeah, move. Your, go ahead and do your movement. I thought you already moved. Sorry. Can't even see the tech marine. Forty-four. And Forty-five. So I would end up about here ish. Let's hope the elevator actually works. Oh my god, that's so just a half here. loot. That would be a troll Don't and a half. Give him ideas. We get Let's there. Do the first All right. Time. <laughs> Three turns to fix them. Hey. <laughs> Imagine the combined weight of uh, six <laughs> of our, all of our six. Marines are just uh, damaging the elevator. the size of these crates, I'm pretty sure that elevator can handle you all. <laughs> well, are the crates full of lead or feathers? That's the real question. Are they full of tungsten? So tungsten crates? I guess we'll see next turn. <laughs> yeah. We'll see next session. Unless we're getting in the elevator, if we're going to do that turn. We might be able to. All right. If the GMs look for it. Okay. They did their movements. And then. Dominangus, go! So they are now in the room. All right. Dominangus is going to move through. Uh, he's going to just. Uh, on the way, he's just going to tackle one of the crates just to see what's inside. As it, like, just passing by. <laughs> to see what's inside this crate. Weapons. Weapons. All right. Weapons and are heavy. We should be fine. Yeah, a lot of a lot of imperial arms. Like. Is there like a button uh, I can press? Uh, Dominica can press. <laughs> uh, he he sees the elevator button. He clicks it, and he hears a something come on from down below. He's here. Mm -hmm. I was to say, are these Volkites by chance? Oh, no. Oh, it's the elevator to come up. Yeah, yeah it's going to be... It'll be a holdout <laughs> mission where we have to hold out until the elevator gets up here, and then we can bail. It's oh, going to be shit. the end of Dominica's turn. Yeah, the elevators aren't known to be quick, but so are go. They are Wait, are, or they? Not? They are not? Okay. They are not. They are not. This is the elevator from Aliens. Right. The it's freight a... elevator. Oh, man. It's a good thing there's some melee boyos back here. Right, but we'll probably end it once you guys get to the elevator area. Yeah, that would be a good place to call it. Right, and then next is, uh, you can... Oh, boy, I don't know. There might be a party wipe if they hit you. But you guys have plenty of cover. I don't know, man. Room. It might, it might not. Well, might I'm not. taking cover behind the pillars. So. I see. I've, I've got enough XP. I could just purchase a couple of powers that might really benefit us. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so is everyone at the elevator yet? No. Not yet. We're, we're still going through our turn order. Okay, Persara went. Karnoff, go. Should I just hold here for melee? No, you should not. You want to move forward uh, cl yes. closer to you? Okay. Yes. Karnoff will actually stand right where he stands. Oh, that's gonna be literally where I was about to go. Uh, if you if you if you uh, speak on the comms about that, I can move. 
No, I'm looking to see if there's anywhere else nearby I can take cover at. Mm -hmm. I'm further back here, than you. Maybe uh, you could also maybe maybe here. I guess is also that's place. literally where I was I was pinging. Yeah. You said so, no. Here or here. Uh, up go, to you I'll if go. you want to stay and so close up to them. I would I would not, but up to you. Actually, alternatively, we can just swap places because, uh, yeah, you know what? Karnoff is going to move up here. You have, so you gonna, have more movement than I there. don't you? Correct. Yes. That makes sense. So, so if you move, move back there, yes, that's going to be in my turn. And you can just move up, down there on your turn. Yes. Uh, Boko, that's our movements for Garnov and Kieran. Shield ready, sh uh, spear ready. Okay, uh, who else has left to move? Tech Marine. Yeah, Tyson. Yep. Yeah, Tyson, go. Alright, I'm me. just booking it right to the elevator area. Yep. And obviously it's not here yet, so... Yep, Heracleides, go. Yeah, oh. What if we determine what the keyboard button was for rotating your character? Hold E. Uh, yeah. Hold E and roll and roll Ah, perfect. Wheel. Thank you. Alright, so I can just get right here. I just put everybody within my... Woohoo! <laughs> just barely. Actually, hold on. I'm going to do it unfettered. Uh-oh. It's fine. Uh, so, that way I can move further closer here and get everybody in range. Uh, I was about to say, if you stand there, I could just hold the shield out over you instead of me. Well, I also have a, uh, I have an iron halo. Oh, well then, that's yeah, the exact same thing. Never mind. Yeah. Nice. You don't get a shield. Oh, hold on. You don't there get one. Now everyone's in range. I didn't roll doubles. Uh, so I don't have to roll on the chart. Sweet. And, uh, everyone now has possibility shield. So we'll end it here. Awesome. Good ending point. Good that was a fun well. session. Yeah. Nice. You I guys especially like great. the graphic depiction of that spear killing. Yeah. Like, here, brother, let me show you how to really use the melee weapon. Spanking <laughs> <laughs> him. <laughs> you pulled your sword out of that guy's corpse, right? I did. Yep. Oh, yeah, he did. <laughs> Wait, are, are you examining your sword? Because it's still not shaving or revving up. Wait, or doing wait, it's still not revving up? Mm -mm. I have a knife oh. you can borrow. I, I have plenty of weapons on myself. Don't worry about it. Don't, don't <laughs> have plenty of weapons. Yes, Talk he's a walking he's arsenal. A yes. Yeah, I have, I have two guns on me. My left and my right. It's okay. All right. I'll MacGyver this shit. Just throw it at me. <laughs> yeah, I don't think <laughs> you're near him. I don't think you're near uh, right. You can throw it to me I'm and right then I can throw it to him, but that would be... Don't worry, you have a nice catching mitt right in your uh, servo arm there. No, so that's a no my servo arm is... My used. servo arm is hoisting yeah, a... Uh... That's what I said. Catching yeah. it. Yeah, that's oh. a 40 meter yeet. So what you're saying is <laughs> that this half-dead marine... Catch it with the half-dead marine, yeah. Okay, yeah. how about this? When we passed by each other, I took his sword. That would have made a lot more sense. I don't think I would have. In, mm, you would have done that unless you do beforehand. When, when yeah. yeah, when I'll I you, picked I'll up the sword, inspector. yeah, like I attacked the guy. I saw that it stopped. I was like, okay, maybe he just hit the bone or something. Uh, then I picked it up. I did not rev it up, so I would not know about the, this function. Gotcha. Yep. Yeah. So next time, oh, we'll have to make a note of that. Actually, I'll remember that. Your next weapon. Next time we'll find out the hard way. work. I mean, you can still use it as a whacking <laughs> stick, for sure. Just the um, revving up part is not working. I still have, like, the standard issue of a surface chainsword, and I have a combat knife on me, so it's okay. Right. I just have those dangling on, like, on my belts. Yep, sweet. Uh, 2,000 XP. Oh, Boom. Shit. Easy 2K. Nice. Yeah, because I of I can't wait till we can just spend that XP. It will be after this mission. <laughs> oh. All right. We'll be rank five. Yeah. Nice. How much XP did y'all have now? Like, like almost. I 10? am 
560 points away from rank 5 currently right. for spent XP. What's, right. uh, what's the threshold got, for rank 5? Uh, 30,000 is rank 5. Okay. Yeah, I'm like 50 away from rank that. No. 10,000? 10, 10,000 XP from around. level 5, but like, I have a bunch of XP to spend after yeah. that. Yeah. 4,700 from it. He said 30. Yeah, yeah, kudos not getting murdered there, uh, North. Well, I so what can fully draw? expected to get murdered. <laughs> I, well, had you stepped in the open with him, but like, well, now I gotta roll dice, see which one's gonna be. I, no, I had the foresight, <laughs> too. I'm just gonna go up to him to try and touch him. He's probably shell-shocked. And then I just saw everything down there, and I was like... <gasps> and then he immediately gets murdered. And then I was like, no! He gets <laughs> almost <laughs> murdered. <laughs> he's still alive. He's still alive, though, so it's okay. We can still yeah. suffer. He we took a big old, him. yeah, big old energy blast to the chest. We have the technology. We can yeah, save him. Yes. Yes. We can All rebuild right. him. <laughs> Better, faster, <laughs> stronger. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. I gotta take a shower and all that. All right. All right. All right. Well, Thank thanks you. for the fun, guys. See oh, you yeah. all next week. Cheers. Yep, yep. Well, we'll have one more next week, won't we? Yes. It'll oh, be boy. extra fun. Yeah. Well, the same number of characters, just more people. Yes. I'm mean, hoping nobody has any issues next week. Uh, I, no. no. I blocked off my Sunday mornings. I didn't feel like doing anything at 5. Yeah, barring emergencies. They have uh, unless we get invaded, we should be good. I need By to the Chinese? You yeah. need to run the Chinese invasion simulation in the uh, Fallout thing? No, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Figure out these macros a little better, because I am not familiar with these at all. All right, so uh, I can give you a crash course once again. <laughs> sure. Yeah, let me make sure. Well, let me make sure I got these right, because okay, so additional strength bonus for input. Uh, eight, that's basically eight. for, for example, uh, melee characters have this. No, other characters can uh, have that as well, but uh, uh, melee characters can get this talent called frenzy, which gives them plus ten to strength. Uh, which raises their strength bonus by one. Uh, however, that is not really reflected on the character sheet. Uh, mm. So you do need to like manually change it and stuff like that. So I don't have that. I have uh, the Blade Master, uh, Crushing Blow, which affects I'll melee. See you later. Stay All right, safe. see you. Have fun. Don't die. Yeah, have uh, fun, guys. Have fun too. Later. All right, see, see you. you.